What's up, Space Cadets? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my Imperial Galactic Survival Let's Play. This is episode 13, and let's get this uh, done right off the bat. Before I forget, we have our top three names set up for the poll for the name of the ship. Actually, we have a few ships here to name, but we're going to just talk about this ship for now. By the way, um, the reason you can't see the names of the ship is because I hit F6, which takes off the names of the of uh well i can't see the name of the ship either way but f6 takes off the the little like uh icons and stuff see so that's pretty cool anyway um what are we gonna name this ship okay so like i said i i took the three top rated comments um on god episode 10 this is taking me way longer than i meant to all right so with nine votes uh cory powell uh wants me to name it valkyrie with five votes, uh, Se Sefri Sefrian, I'm sorry, I'm not sure to say your name, uh, wants me to name it Dragonfly. And f um, we have an honorable mention here um, for with four votes, with Joe Nalfwa, um, wants me to name the ship Bloaty McBloatface. And the reason it's an honorable mention is because it was tied with another with another uh, another name, but the thing is the, uh, the other name, which was... With four votes by Ranger, um, wanted me to name it the SS Four Days. And the only reason I went with uh, Ranger over Joe was because Ranger put his uh, his comment and his you know ship name in first, and they both got four votes. So what I want you guys to do now is look in the top right hand corner. Uh, make sure your annotations is off. Look in the top right hand corner. There's going to be a vote for the ship name. Uh, all three of those names are going to be up there. And just you know, do me a favor. Vote for what ship you wh what name you would want the ship to have. And we're talking about this ship right here. All right. So with that out of the way, let's get let's get on with the episode. Okay. So a lot of you guys mentioned to me uh, something I could do about these. Um, these like cement blocks not lining up by the way we missed one here hold on there we go someone mentioned to me about these cement blocks not lining up well, actually a bunch of you've mentioned this to me uh in the comments what you can do is you can take the what's this tool called the change and rotate tool and you can basically rotate these to go the way you want them to go so that's what we're gonna do oh oh it might not work with this one. Oh, it might not work with the corner blocks hmm you know, with these, uh, because if I rotate them, it's going to get rotated. Uh, is there anything I could do about that? See, anytime I rotate this, it's going to be like, see, that's what it would be like. Um, I'm going to mess around with these off camera, see if I see if there's anything I can do about them. But in the meantime, we can go ahead and rotate all these to make sure they're facing the right way. Right here. Great, great, uh, great catch on that, guys. What I was planning to do was I was planning on knocking out these blocks and replacing them, uh, you know, until they are facing the right way. But uh, this is obviously a better plan. And as you can see here, I did put lights down on the deck of this uh, area. Um, some of you did not want me to put lights on the floor. And to be perfectly honest, I didn't want to put lights on the floor either. But honestly, I had no choice. Because um, if I didn't, this whole area would just be dark at night. So I don't really like the idea of these lights being on the ground. But, you know, it's better than the alternative of the game um, being dark. Boom, 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 boom. All right, I'll do the rest of these off camera. I just wanted to see, I just wanted to show you how I was doing it. Man, a lot of these are really facing the wrong way, huh? All right, let's do the rest of those off camera. All right, so I did bring my ships up here. Um, this is where I'm going to park my ships for the time being. And as you can see right here, this is what I'm going to be doing with these railings. Okay, so uh, let's go ahead and put down some more railings. And uh, again, I'm not going to do this all this on camera, but I do want to show you how this is going to work. So number six, you got to right click and then choose railing slope. And there you go. And then you just go like this. Pretty cool, huh? I love these, uh, these railing slopes. These things are pretty freaking sweet. We'll just put these down until we don't have any more. And there we go. I'll make some more. Um, in between videos. So that's going to be the railings. So there you go. Alright, the other thing I want to do is I actually have um, a bunch of glass made up here. And we're going to go ahead and make more railings as well. I did go I did go ahead and get uh, Promethium and Iron in between videos. Because I said I would. And um, I actually had time, so that's pretty cool. Uh, what am I looking for? Oh yeah. I'm looking for these. 
Go ahead and make some of those. And what we're going to do with these uh, glass is we're going to put these up here. You can see how I put the glass up there. I put two pieces, right? You don't need to do that. What you, what you could do is you can take the glass and, again, right click and look at, all the look at all the options for glass. So you take this one and there you go. How much nicer is that, right? Oh, do I have to do it every time? No, there we go. That looks so much nicer. So let's do that all around in here. Okay, let's get up here. Okay, so that looks much, much better. And uh, for those of you who are wondering how my farm's going, let's go check it out. Um, I did pick... Oh, I picked everything, but the... Um, the pumpkins weren't ready. It looks like the... Um, it looks like these... Oh, damn it, I don't want to say their name because you guys keep telling me how to pronounce Doreens, and I know I'm saying it wrong. Doreen, Doreens? Doreens? I don't know. I really don't care. Um, I'll try and remember. I'll get it eventually, but I hate saying it because you guys tell me, and you tell me on stream, and you tell me in the comments, and I'm like, oh, okay, cool. That's how... And like for some reason, I have some kind of mental block with that, with that item. I just have trouble saying it the way you're supposed to say it. <sighs> I'll get it eventually. Anyway, um, so let's come on out here. And I think what we're going to do is we're going to make our next room. And I think our next room is going to be over here. And it is going to be the farm. So let's start placing down some blocks here. Uh, nothing fancy. It's just going to be steel block um, floor. So I'm trying to think of how big I want this to be. I don't think it really matters for the time being. Let's just make it a uh, 5x5 five five for, for now. And um, I've got some ideas on how I want to make this room. I just don't know how I'm going to make it yet. Uh, let's do this. There we go. Wow, that barely even came out. Okay, let's try that again. Yeah, it looks like it's like... Yeah, there, there we go. That worked. We got to take down that tree, probably. All right, so... Basically, this is gonna be there's gonna be a walkway up the front of this room, and on the sides is gonna be all the farms. How am I gonna make the farms? Yeah, I got some ideas. I got some ideas. So let's go ahead and take the texture symbol tool, and uh, how about this for the? No, God, that looks horrendous. Um, what, what are, which one of these look? Like? That kind of looks like a floor. That kind of looks like a floor. That doesn't look like a floor. That could be a floor. Hmm. I kind of think I like... That looks pretty cool. I can live with that. So that's going to be the walkway. And then what we're going to do is... We are going to have... We need some more iron blocks. Let's go get some more iron blocks uh, cooking up. Or steel blocks, sorry. And um, we'll get those started up and then we'll get something to eat because uh, my guy apparently is very hungry. All right, more steel blocks. And let's grab some food. All right. Uh, oh, by the way, you can change a lot of the things about these lights, like their intensity and their colors, and I was going to do that, and I still might do it, but the problem is you have to do it one light at a time, which is a goddamn travesty. It is so difficult. You could press P, and you could come over here to the light-like thing, but you can't... I guess you could do all lights, but look, if you do all lights, there's no option up here. The only time you get these options... Is when you're only get is when you're only highlighting one light, which is really annoying. An, an easier way to do lights is you go up to it and you press P, and then you can choose the um, the color like that. What, what kind of color do you think would be in here? Probably red. Yeah, something like that. But you know that's gonna take a while. I'm, I don't know if I want to put in the time to be honest. It's just gonna take too long. They need to figure out an easier, quicker way to do that. Okay. You know what? I changed my mind. For a farm, I think we're going to go with wood. Can I do wood textures even though it's not wood? I can. So for a farm, I'm thinking wood might be the better way to go. How about that? Oh, God, that looks horrendous. 
Uh, it's facing the wrong way. Ah, whatever, I can change it. Okay, so let's just do this. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. So now we need um, a way to... Well, I th we're going to need two things. We're going to need a stairway because my... Uh, my my like gardens are gonna be off the ground farms whatever you want to call them they're gonna be off the ground um, the first thing what we're gonna need now is growing plots I'm trying to think of how I want to do this um, I think what we're gonna do is this is gonna have to be a wall all right let's just put up the wall for now and then this is going to be um, I need some growing plots Let's go make some growing plots and give me just a minute to think about how I want to do this. Okay. While I was uh, crafting and thinking about things, I actually looked up the pronouncement of Durian. Uh, I actually put it in a search engine, like, like looked up the uh, proper pronunciation. Durian. I got it. <laughs> All right. So what we're going to do here is we didn't get the growing plots, which was kind of a mistake, but that's okay. We don't need them for what we're going to do for now. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to come up here. This is going to be like this. And then the growing plots are going to be right here. Let me. This is going to be really big and really. Uh, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Overdone. Like there's going to be a lot of extra room here. Um, we're going to be using just to for cool factor that we don't really need. That I just I like building that way. Um, so that comes out one. That's the middle two three, and this comes across like this. So this will be like that. That'll be good. We're going to need to bring our. Our uh, chainsaw over here and take care of some trees, too. Alright, so what you're going to do is you're going to walk up here. And this is going to be the growing plots. One, two, three. And there's a way to walk around it. Then there's the wall behind it. This is exactly what I wanted. And uh, I'm really happy with the way this is this is uh, coming out. This is going to be cool. Alright, what we got to do now is we're going to come over here. And we're going to get some growing plots going. Like, for reals. Alright, so, growing plots. Growing plots are in here. We need nutrient solution for that. What do we need for a nutrient solution? Uh, we need rock dust and purified water. That should not be a problem. Rock dust and purified water. Boom. Make all of that, and then make all of that. We're gonna need metal plates and fiber. Fiber? Really? Where'd I put my fiber? Crap, we need metal plates. Alright. You need to stop. And then I just need metal plates. Metal plates. There we go. Okay. Where's my fiber? I must have a lot of fiber somewhere. Um, I need that. Is that all the fiber we have? That's not a lot of fiber. Can you plant fiber? I don't think you can. It's fiber. Metal plates. Although we can always go find somewhere where there's uh, growing plots and just take those apart. Whenever you take something apart, you get full value for them. So if you find one growing plot and you take it apart, you have enough to build another growing plot. It's that simple. Alright, uh, metal plates. Yeah, take those. Put those in here. I only need to take two fibers, so that's going to be quite a bit of growing plots. So that's not that's not bad. That's not bad. Alright. Alright, let that do its thing. And while that's doing its thing, we'll go over here and continue working. Now this is, looks very square and very stupid. Um, Don't worry about it. We'll take care of it afterwards. Alright, so we come up here. I think what we're going to do is we're going to take some of these down here. And... Do we want to do them like that? Actually, that looks pretty cool, just like that. I need something over here. I don't know what to put there, though. Honestly, I don't know if I want to just put blocks there. Is there any kind of um, decoration thing I can put there that would be cool? Let's try and think outside the box, right? Where'd I put that? God damn it. Alright. Let's try and think outside the box here. What can we do? Uh, let's go to tech tree. I believe you get um, decoration blocks automatically. So let's see what kind of decoration blocks we can make. I don't know what we would put over there, honestly. Like, 
like fancy computer terminals really don't fit in like a farm area. Uh, really, that's all the decoration blocks? I must be missing something. Hold on. Do I do I have to like learn any of them? I don't think so. Tools hover miscellaneous. Yeah, I don't even see the decoration blocks in here. Wouldn't be under weapons or tools. We looked under miscellaneous. Base. Yeah, yeah, I don't know where the decoration blocks are. I guess you just get them automatically, but there's not a lot of them. Where the hell are all the decoration blocks? This is a decoration. No, no, warp, warp drive tank. Never mind. That used to be a decoration block. Not anymore. Huh. Well, okay. Let's look at our extremely limited amount of decoration blocks. I wonder what a console block looks like. Let's find out. Um, antenna wouldn't look good in there. Artificial indoor plants. Yes. But we don't have any raw plastic and we can't get any because we need corn for that. Um, let's see what that looks like. That goes on the roof. And um, we need plastic materials for that as well. Okay. So put this in here. This should be doing fine. Is that the first one coming out? No. Seven. All right. Well, we want nine, so let's just wait for nine. If we're not going to put decoration blocks, it's not the end of the world. We could just put, you know, like ramps or something down here. I don't know. I don't know. Is there anything we could put here that would look cool? Hmm. Kind of looks interesting, I guess. Like that. That doesn't look bad. Honestly, I think these slope things would be the best. You put that slope one, and then you put the ramp bottom. What about these? Well, that wouldn't look bad. Ooh, pillars. Pillars. Do you think pillars would look good with glass? I've never thought of it. Let's put a pillar there and a pillar here. And let's put glass in between them. I've never, I've never thought of this. Seven. No, because you know why? Because the glass doesn't go in the middle. Damn it. Oh, it's a bummer. Why can't the glass go in the middle? Give us the option for that. Damn it. Well, I definitely want to use glass with these, so... Eh, glass does not work well with, um, with pillars, unfortunately. Ah, it's a bummer. Well, let's see what else we can work with here. These... Nah. Uh, no, 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 no. That doesn't look bad. We could Maybe we could uh, use this as a skate park. Actually, that might look good with the windows. Maybe. Maybe. That's, um, that's my second choice. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Look, you get a skateboard and be like... And then we're going to have them on this side, too. Oh, man. It could be our farm slash skate park. I'm, I'm on to this, man. This needs to happen. That's it, guys. Um, what do I want in my next um, open world galactic uh, survival game? Skateboards. Come on. Make it happen, people. All right. So let's take a look at this thing. And what was the other decoration block? This one right here. All right. Let's take a look at these, see what they look like. Maybe we can use them. I don't know. Uh. Eh. You could, oh, you know what you could think? You know what this could be? A giant freaking heater. Oh, maybe. I could see that. Alright, what's this thing look like? Oh, that looks pretty cool, too. I like that. Put that right there. Put it right here. Nah. There. What is it supposed to be? Yeah. Actually, I kind of like that. Yeah. I like that. That looks so cool. Probably put it on the other side. All right, so i trying to think of how many plots we're going to need. Uh, we're definitely going to use this as a heater. Um, I'm just not sure where we're going to put it. We're going to hold off until we're going to hold off until um, we finalize the room because I want to put it like in the middle of the room, and it'll be like um, maybe like the idea is that the uh, the room the room needs to have like a lot of uh, moisture and heat. You know, like when you're growing plants. I guess I don't know. Maybe I think I can go with that. All right. So what did I make here? Shoot, I don't remember. Uh, oh yeah, over here, growing plots. Alright, another six. We need nine for each growing plot set. I'm thinking six sets of growing plots, so six times nine. That's what I'm, that's what I'm thinking of. I think that should be plenty.
Now here's the thing, do we want the whole thing to be a glass dome? I kind of think so. I kind of really think so. Let's, um, let's see what we can do here. Uh, four. Yeah, there we go. Big ass freaking glass. Hells yeah. Oh, it's not... No, that's not good. Well, we can't, oh, we can't put glass here and glass on the corner either, can we? Ah, damn it, I hate that. Can we put, like, um... Oh, uh, something like this, maybe? Yes. Oh, yes. Yes, that needs to happen. Uh, oh, what am I doing? Build with the freaking drone, bro. Drone is F5. There we go. Okay. So this one goes right here. Am I putting down glass? God, I'm an idiot. Why was I doing that? I got confused on which, which button did what. Man, this is going to be an awesome room, dude. Okay, we're back. I just grabbed the screenshot, and um, I think this is going to look good. I think this is going to look good. Very, very nice. Let's um, let's continue working. Alright, so number six. Um, I kind of wish they had, like, longer pieces of glass for these, like, corner things. But, you know. What are you going to do? Oops, there we go, there we go. Now, how do we fit something in the corner over here? Well, that's easy enough. Just like this, bam. This is going to be the coolest greenhouse ever made. Come on, it's a little tricky to get it in these corners here. Come on. Alright, how am I supposed to do this easily? Well, let's go back down here. No? Oh! Oh! I had it. There we go. Just gonna get it right in the corner there. It's not easy. Come on. Come on. There you go. There you go. Come on. Now the problem with this thing is it's gonna be really hard to light this up during the day. You know? But uh, I don't have any way to... Uh, you can't put lights on glass. At least I don't think you can. Let's try. Why not, right? Seven. Nope. Pretty sure you can't. No. You can't even put them near the glass. I can always put them on the floor. Oh, no, I can't. Oh, I kind of messed this up a little bit, didn't I? Ah, crap. This is a walkway over here, and this is only single walkway. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that. Mm. Ah, I don't know how I want to handle this now. Well, I guess it really doesn't matter. And it gives us a way to put lights over here, at least. See, we're going to have, like, extra walkways over here. And you have this, like, little area right here, which is really kind of weird. Um, now, let me see if there's something I could do about this. Uh, hold on, let me see. let me see what I can do about this. See, because what's happening is you're able to walk up on the wall where the, where, you know, the door part would be. That's very strange for a building. Let's, um, let's see if there's something we can do here with this. Not a ramp. Maybe something like this. Oh, you know what? We can't even put anything here because the glass is taking up this block. Ah, damn it. Oh, that's not good. Uh, well, that's going to be there no matter what. I kind of like this setup. I don't mind the extra walking area over here. Maybe it'll it'll be good because then I can put some lights down here. That's fine. I just got to think about something to do with this. Uh, well, let's take this tool right here. No, not that tool. Um, this tool, we can't do anything to this thing. Let's take it down. And at least make it, um, well, we can't make it round. Because we won't be able to... No, we can't make around because we won't be able to put down... 
Well, we could do something like that. Oh, that looks good. That looks cool. I like that. Look at that. It's going to be the opposite of that. There's no opposite of this. I need this, but opposite. All right, I'm going to think about this off camera because I'm not really sure what I want to do here. Anywho, we uh, we got the basic uh, idea of this place set up, and I think it's going to be a pretty cool uh, uh, place for us to grow our plants and stuff. I'm very excited about it. And that's going to be it for episode 13. We'll see you next time for episode 14. Till then, take it easy.